Hey guys, what's up? So I'm getting all these questions on Facebook and YouTube about this black arm. Oh my God, he's all of a sudden a madman. <laughs> oh, the black. Kept Tegan though, it's a great tattoo. All black, bro. All right, so what is the meaning behind the black sleeve, let alone the black sleeves, because this guy's gonna be covered up next. Full sleeves, wrist to shoulder, all black. I don't regret getting any of my tattoos. If you guys followed me back when I made the tattoo video, which I'll post down below, because a lot of people, you know, when they watch your videos, they don't ever go back and watch some of your first videos. I have a lot of videos. I'm damn near 300 videos already in one year of YouTube. It says that I've been a YouTube person since 2013, but I just had an account to watch videos. I had to like, to watch other friends' videos that I had watched over the years. Like I had to create an email and so it's been there since then, but I actually started posting videos a year ago, a year and a couple of months. But anyways, um, I'll post a tattoo video down below about all my tattoos, every tattoo on my body, like 30 something tattoos, all of them mean something to me. And like besides one, and that's the fish on my ankle, which I got for free. So like I was just like, oh, I want a fish to go down on my ankle because I have a koi fish on my leg. So I got it. It's cool, but it doesn't mean anything to me. And it's like, oh, why is that even there? Like, <laughs> anyways. The black sleeve is something that I've been just wanting to do for over a decade. Like, I used to completely hate tattoos. Hated tattoos growing up. Um, I grew up around some sketchy ass people. My mother was a heroin addict. All of their friends lived on the street. They had tattoos that said Sally in cursive, crossed out, Meredith under that, crossed out. Billy Joe under that, you know, <laughs> like just tat like bad tattoos. They were green and I Just looked at tattoos as like garbage um, And so Yeah, um, I never wanted a tattoo I could tell I got into my 20s and I <laughs> Yeah Sorry, I lost my train of thought. <laughs> like I got all these like YouTube pop-ups right here and it like threw me off. Anyways, um, in my 20s, uh, I got Torrance on my arm. That was my first tattoo and it wasn't the way I wanted it. I had gone over that tattoo five times and it still wasn't the way I wanted it even though you know I wanted it, it was a Japanese banner and it was supposed to be in Japanese but the people at the tattoo place couldn't get Torrance in Japanese, they can only get Tori, and that's not her name. So I just, we did like a comic font of lettering, and I was like, oh, okay, cool, like I'll get that, like as in like, okay, I'll just settle. Um, a lot of my tattoos all had meaning, all of them do, but the quality of my tattoos were never how I wanted, besides a few of them. Um, so, I had just thought and thought and thought, and I'd never done it because it's so intense and like I've always been interested, but I wanted to make sure that I'm committed because this is a huge commitment. Yes, I've had, I've had full sleeves now for years, but doing this is a big commitment and it's mentally and physically draining to do, let alone you have to worry about fitting in in society, which people know me like all around the world, like, just because I'm blacking out my arms doesn't mean I'm a prick. Like, everybody knows me for who I am, and if somebody's gonna judge me or not give me a job because of my arms being blacked out or a tattoo on my body, then I don't need to be there. I don't need to be around that person. So if my tattoos offend you, then you know, then maybe you're not supposed to be in my life because I only want people in my life that love me for who I am and who are gonna make me thrive in life. I don't need anybody that's gonna like bring me down in life because I'm all about living the fullest life possible and I have my goals 
and I'm gonna get those goals on my own. So if you don't wanna be a part of that, then that's fine, that's cool. So I decided finally, after like 11 years, that I'm just gonna go for it. I'm gonna start blacking out my arms. I have the opportunity to. I've been working so hard, it's not even funny. Like, I'm like mentally drained all the time and I'm trying to make time for pleasure. I'm so excited for Thailand. So I am trying to get this arm finished up and then it, once I get a good amount saved, I'm gonna start working on the right arm slowly and try to get that knocked out by the time I go to Thailand. Um, with the whole me buying this new uh, giant adventure bike, like, you know, it's taking away from the tattoo, but that's okay because this bike is gonna just literally like make my next year of cycling phenomenal. Like, I'm gonna just take my cycling to the next great heights. But anyways, I'm getting off subject, sorry. Um, the tattoos, man, like it's about happiness for me. The black, the all black represents happiness. Me being satisfied with my body. Me not being satisfied with my body f for my whole life. Like I've never been fully satisfied with my body. I'm not right now. Uh, continuously in the pursuit of perfection. Nobody's perfect, but there is nothing wrong with the pursuit of perfection.